So today I'm going to show you how to remove and replace the RAM in an IBM Lenovo T60 laptop. The section we're going to be removing is the palm rest. The RAM chips sit right under here. Uh, it's very similar across models, the ThinkPad models, the X series, R series, T series, many of them will have this configuration. Uh, really it just depends on which one, but most of them are like this. First thing you're going to want to do is flip it over, remove the battery, and then you're going to locate the four palm rest screws. Now these are going to be indicated with a small RAM chip icon. You can use a standard screwdriver to remove these. They'll come right out. If you don't have a magnetized screwdriver, I recommend using a pick, something like that, so you can get them out. Just make sure you're using the right size screwdriver or you'll strip the screws. And it's a real pain to get replacements and then remove the gnarled ones if you mess them up. Okay, now that those four screws are removed, we're going to flip it over and you're going to tuck your fingers underneath the palm rest right here and just pull up. And this piece is going to come right up. There will be a cable underneath. Pop it out and remove the palm rest. Now you'll notice there are two RAM chips installed. Press the levers out. So you're just going to pry them out and the RAM chip will pop up. You'll be able to remove it. Do the same for the other one. Pull it right out. Now I'm going to install a two gigabyte module in the bottom slot. To do this, angle it at 45 degrees press all the way in, make sure it's fully seated, and then press down. You'll hear it click into place. And I have a one gigabyte module, and I'm going to install this one right here. That'll give me a total of three gigabytes. Uh, actually with the T60s, that's probably the best configuration you can use. You can install four gigabytes if you want, but the chipset will not see it all, even if you use a 64 gig. 64-bit uh, operating system. So now I've got three gigabytes installed. Place the connector for the palm rest back in the little hole. Push it down, make sure it's firmly seated. Now to get this palm rest back on, you're going to want to make sure that it hooks up underneath and it should fall right into place. So make sure it's hooked. There are two lips on the sides here. You want to make sure that those fully press in and it clicks right in. Okay, So you shouldn't have to force it. Uh, it'll fall right into place, click right in there. Close it and then reassemble. And in just, I don't know, five minutes or so, you greatly improve the performance of your laptop. T60 is an older model, but upgraded to three gigs of RAM, it's still perfectly serviceable. Uh, as you'll notice, this screw did not screw in. That's because when you press down on the screw, it pushes the palm rest away. If you do the outside screws first, it'll secure the palm rest up and you'll more easily be able to screw in the other, the middle two. That's it. T60 with three gigs of RAM.